Hello everyone. This video is about uh, how to use the PX scale simulation in order to be able to answer the questions in the lab. You can start by clicking on the play button here and then you can see here the PH scale and on the scale you can see that the upper part is basic while the lower part is acidic. PH of 7 is neutral. Anything above 7 is basic while anything below 7 is acidic. And the lower the value of the pH, the higher the acidity. And by the same talking, the higher the value of pH, the higher the basicity of the solution. Now let's see how we can use this simile to answer the questions in the lab. Here in this menu, you can see several chemicals or items that we can measure the pH value for. So if we start with the chicken soup, for example, you can control the volume, how much volume you want to test for each item. For example, for chicken soup, if you look at the scale here, you can see the scale start from 0, then this would be 0 0.1 liter, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4. This increment is 0 0.5, and so on, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, 0 0.9, and 1 liter. Let's say you are asked to add 0.2 liters, so 0.2 liters will be up to this increment, to this mark. So we can add here 0.2, slowly, and you can see here the marker will tell you how much volume you added so far. Okay, so that's 0.2 liters. And if you are asked to measure the pH, you have to drag the sensor of the pH, which is this one here, and place it inside the solution. And you can see here it gives you the value of the pH. Now, sometimes you'll be asked to add water up to a certain mark. Let's say, for example, if you're asked to add water up to 0.5 liters, then you turn on the water until you reach, and you can do it slowly, until you reach 0.5 liters. And you'll answer the questions over the changes on the pH and so on. You can also decrease the volume of the solution by using this faucet here. You can get rid of some of the solution. Remember, this menu here has all the items that you need to test for. Hope you find this video educational. Thank you.